Okay, this time we'll definitely beat the game. Oh, it's an urgent mission. Ultimate satellite based beam weapon. It's like Project 4, right? We'll definitely be needing those guys. Cool thing is, yeah, you can. Once you combine them, you can basically make a little beam shop. It's pretty cool, if you ask me. And this is. This is the project form of the game. Just like in UN Squadron, the last level was basically taking out this humongous piece of weaponry that has 20 parts to it or something. And off to a crappy start, apparently. I would say this. It's definitely harder than Project 4. If you thought Project 4 was hard, just wait. It gets better, trust me. I'm gonna keep going. I don't recall really engines shooting out fireballs, but hey. Not really around thrusters too much. Oh, bullet hell, how I love you. Those games are probably like considerably easy compared to like recent bullet hell games. I'm just not that good at them, but hell, this is not me from playing them. <laughs> that take like half my life. Yeah, I gotta make sure you don't get hit by that. It's not too hard to dodge. It'll give you a warning flame before it actually shoots the whole thing out. So then when you take that out, you gotta get the top part now. That turret's kind of tricky to hit, especially when you have those lasers and missiles at you. Uh, I don't know how I dodged that. Oh, come on. There. Happy? What is that, a nuke? Ah, oh, crap. It does take half your life off. Make, make sure you don't get hit by it. Now it shoots fireballs. Oh, man, I shouldn't have gone down. Yeah, that was just, that was, that was just a warm-up, guys. Here comes the real boss. Damn you. Damn you. I swear it looks like you're not even on the Earth anymore. It looks like you're in outer space. Apparently, Rabu loves lasers. Hell, I love lasers. Lasers are awesome. Needs more pew pew pew, though. Oh, that was cheap. No matter where I moved, I would have got shot anyways. Oh yeah, the shuttle? The shuttle's not the boss. That's the boss. It's our awesome satellite. It apparently has 20 different types of weapons on it. Yeah, this thing kicks Project 4's ass. I probably wasted two dollars on this thing already. Look at this! Oh boy. In 
no, honestly, though, this part isn't too hard. You just gotta move with the lasers. Make sure when it charges up, so you can go right above or below it. This is kind of annoying, but nothing you can handle. You can't handle. This is kind of annoying, yeah. Satellite will shoot the lasers and it'll bounce it off those two things, so you gotta move as soon as it hits those two things. Otherwise, you are screwed. The tricky part is dodging that while dodging the lasers, the other lasers, and the missiles. Still gotta perfect that part, as you can see. Probably don't want to be in the middle. Yeah, I think she dodged that time. Not that time, though. Damn, finally. God. Mission accomplished. Prepare for the crappiest ending ever. Besides the crap load of points. Oh man. Good game though. Oh no, our plane breaks down. It's like we're going back into orbit or something. <laughs> I would hope so. God damn. The technology's insane. Yeah, that's your ending right there. Hey! Let's eject from our plane and get picked up. The end. Then again, though, many shooter games don't really have great endings. But seriously, just that? Come on. Pretty long game, though. What, an hour or something? Hell yeah! Top score, you can't t top this! And that, my friends, was Carrier Airwing. Oh, it's been Impact. Sorry, I've gotten tired. Played over here, but... I hope you enjoyed this short LP, and next time, hmm, good question, what will I play? Oh, I'm sure we'll figure it out. Till then, thanks for watching.